What's going on everybody? It's your fly tech guy Mark with Wondershare Dr. Phone. And today we're going to be talking about iMessages. Now when you set up iMessages, you use your Apple ID so that they will sync across all devices, but sometimes it doesn't sync and sometimes it gets messed up along the way. Well, that's what we're here to help you with. But before we get into it, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and click the bell for notifications so you don't miss more videos like this one. But without further ado, let's dive right in. The first way to try and fix this problem is going in settings and then clicking on messages and turning on iMessages and making sure that it is using the correct Apple ID. Now if it's already turned on, you can try just turning off and turning on this feature one more time to kickstart the synchronization process. The next way that we can try and solve this issue is going onto our Mac and using our messages there. So we'll go to the message settings and we'll do preferences. Now from here, we're gonna to wanna to uncheck enable this account. From there, you'll wait a couple minutes. I know I did it in a couple seconds, but we'll wait a couple minutes and then we'll turn that back on. And that should try to resync everything back with your iMessages and your iPhone. Another way to check is heading over to Apple's website. From there, you can log in with your Apple ID, the same ID that you think you used for your phone. Now you can head to your account and you'll see if your phone is connected with Apple servers, this way knowing if iMessages is syncing or not. Another way to solve this problem is kind of what we did in the first step. We'll go to settings, then we'll go to messages, and we'll make sure first iMessages is turned on. Then we'll click that user ID, that Apple ID, and make sure that you're using the same Apple ID that you used when we just checked at the Apple website. Now, if you're not, you can change that ID to make sure that it will start to sync your iMessages again. If all else fails, the last thing you can do is try to restart all your devices, your iPhone, your Macs, whatever it may be that holds your user ID and is not working, I would try to restart them all and see if that can start a synchronization process. Other than that, Dr. Phone makes a great software to help you transfer and keep your messages, but it also helps you keep your photos, maybe phone calls, or other things that you may want, files. And it is a great software. It's in their Dr. Phone module suite. So it's under the phone manager, and we're gonna show you how to do that right now. So what we're gonna to do to back up our messages with the Dr. Phone phone manager software is first, obviously, make sure your phone is plugged into your device. Then we're going to open the Wondershare Dr. Phone app suite. Once we do that, we're going to click on Phone Manager. And once that starts to load, you'll see you can back up not just your messages, but music, videos, photos, files, and a numerous other things, which is just an amazing feature that Dr. Phone gives us. We hope that some of the solutions we gave you to solving these problems work. And if not, remember, Dr. Phone has a great software to help you back up those types of things to your devices. Other than that, guys, it's your Fly Tech Guy Mark with Wondershare, and I'll see you in the next one.